back in. Well, you may not know it. I didn't, but there is a unique cave system right here in Northwest Ohio. Yeah, in fact, it is one of only it's it's one of a kind, really. It's open to the public and John Monk goes for his go 419 tonight in Seneca County at the Seneca Caverns. It's definitely a cool thing to do for like an adventure if you're looking for some fun. Discovered in 1872, the Seneca Caverns have been open as a tourist attraction just south of Bellevue since 1933. The caverns, referred to as the Earth Crack, were not carved out by flowing water over centuries, but instead were formed when ancient sediment was dissolved enough for the rock above to fall 7 to 12 feet, creating multiple levels of cavern openings. The biggest room is the fourth level, that's 65 feet below the surface, and that's 250 feet from one end to the other. Now operating its 88th season, the Seneca Caverns has been mostly preserved in its original state. So getting around the one hour guided tour means a little ducking, stepping, and hiking up and down natural stone steps. I think it's the adventure, the mystery of them all, and what is it that they're gonna find when they go down under the ground, and literally under your feet. And once you're done inside with the cave tour, there's a whole other activity you can do outdoors with the kids. You can use this sluice to pan for your own gemstones. Our daughter, this one right here, picking out stones, is uh, she's really into rocks and stuff like that, so we thought it would be a really fun trip to do for them to come down here and do this. And there's more to see than just rocks. Visitors can view fossils, an underground river, and inscriptions from past visitors from more than a century ago. I've heard the use the word authentic experience and I think that that's what people enjoy when they come here. Just an hour drive from Toledo, Seneca Caverns is open all summer long seven days a week and is offering five special booking dates for lantern tours ending on October 5th. Reporting from beneath Seneca County for Go 419, I'm John Monk, WTOL 11. I've explored a cave once, and I, I don't know if you're claustrophobic at all, but there are some tight spaces that you have to maneuver. It's gorgeous. I remember, uh, I think we were driving to Florida mm. when I was a kid, and we stopped maybe in North Carolina, and there were some caves, but I did not know that existed there. Right really in your own backyard. Cool.